for those of you guys who research the Mandela effect, there is a VW sign. As you can see, it's separated. I'm from South Africa. I walk to this VW Golf. Yeah. And I look at this. Uh, what did you like in? No line. Boss Tony. My friend here wants to show me another thing. Where is it? Exactly the same golfs, no? Exactly the same golfs. But this one has got a line. Look at this. Look at this. Can you believe it? See, tell me something. I'm talking English now, but tell me something. Your VW sign. Yeah. How does it look? What does it look like? Does it, has it got a line separate the V from the W? A bit, yeah. It's got? Yeah, it's according to you? Yeah. Always had one? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, there's a little line there. If you look at this golf, yeah. this golf has got a, it's got a line yeah. in between, yeah. alright? Look at this golf here. Yeah. This golf here, yeah, about the same here. Yeah. They haven't, this one hasn't got. I remember the VW sign looking like that. I yeah, don't even... Ones, yeah. No, it hasn't changed. VW has never changed their signs. Well, then those are the cheaper ones then. I don't rem even remember that little piece no. there. Do you remember that little no. piece there? And then it's most probably the cheaper one then. Cheaper version one. It's, they've never changed their logo. It's called the Mandela Effect. Go and have a look at it. <laughs> Look at it, look at it on YouTube, it's called the Mandela Effect. But they, they've changed it now in the old one. The, the history that we remember is not the same as the history that the world tell us about. Okay. Well, have a look. Sure. 